And today we have the star of the show, an Eskimo. Uh. <laughs> it's a Teletubby, the, a grey one. <laughs> I've got two jumpers on. You've got two jumpers on? Yeah. Can't even see you in there. <laughs> Come on. What are we doing? We're aiding. Huh? We're going to carry on. I'm going to set some um, block work out. Uh, the walls, internal walls. And I just thought, fuck it. I'm going to build some corners. Uh, I'm going to build this pot in profiles and that pot in, in, in corners just because I can <laughs> and I feel like it. <laughs> Do you want to I just wanted to quickly show you uh, <laughs> me belt. I've actually got a new belt coming, two new belts coming because sometimes you'll see me not wearing my belt. Uh, it's, it's depending on what I'm doing really. Like today we're setting out with 100% I will wear a belt but by if I have my belt on all day, by 12 o'clock, fuck it, it starts to hurt, it starts to dig in. So I was just doing a little bit of research into belts. Um, but at the minute, I've just got a Stanley pouch. This is just a normal belt with a Stanley pouch added onto it, a hammer holster, and a trail mate, uh, which is seen better days we do the clean um, but it really does start to dig in to here by the end of the day so I've, I've done a bit of research I've got a gator back one coming from America which will be a while and I've got a, a proper d one but it has got some AX braces on it to hold it up for you but this is my setup for uh, setting out so I'll have, I, I keep my, um, so I have a set of corner blocks in there, which is so handy just to put in there. This is, this was my setup for yesterday. I'll then have my pins. I'll put one side into one of the little gaps in there and then the other side there like that i'll have two pencils uh well i've actually got about four in there but i always have two sharpened uh, i'll sharpen it in the morning before i start i have my stanley there and then that goes straight back there like that and i'll have my fat max tape in here which as you can see it it has seen better days <laughs> uh, that's just a fat max. I like these tapes. They're big and beefy and strong. I'll tell you that, it fucking breaks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll have a uh, black marker, permanent marker. That's for marking uh, my window uh, formers. It's good to mark them with them. <clears throat> Pencil's good for marking um, brickwork and block work. But that is my setup for setting out. I will have another set of lines in there as well. Oh, there's a pen there, look. But everything goes back in its place and I can, that's, a chalk, that's a liquid chalk marker, that's for my Blakes, which I'm not obviously gonna need for this plot if I end up doing it all freehand. But this is my setup for setting out. When I'm building a corner, I will because I've got some big boards, I'll just put the tools that I need out on the boards. I don't want to wear my belt if I know I'm staying in one place, but when I'm moving here, I'm setting this out over there, I'm going over there, I'm, I'm checking work, I'm backwards and forwards. It's just really good to have everything on you at all times. Don't listen to any of these old school brickies who don't want to change and um, say it's a load of bollocks, because trust me, I swear to God, if I don't have this on and I'm setting out, Fuck's me fucking trowel now. Where the fuck's me tape? Where the fuck's this? Where the fuck's that? And it is fucking stressful. <laughs> you, when you're setting out and you're doing your measurements and you're checking this and you're checking that and you're doing that, the last thing you want to be doing is looking for these tools. These essential tools that you need all day. Honestly, get yourself a belt if you ain't. 
I've got uh, a proper D Walt one coming with some X braces on it. Um, and I'm going to try it out and see. And I've got a gator back one, which is supposed to be the most comfortable work belt out there, but it costs a lot of money. It's, it cost me about 150 quid for the belt, and it's all come. Uh, I haven't seen it, and it cost me about 90 quid for posters and packaging. So it cost me a few, fair few quid, but they make, they make their money back. These are money makers' belts. Right, anyway, that's fucking enough waffling on. Let's get over there, shall we? Right, we're going to set the internal walls out. I've, the corners are up, you know, the windows are in the right place. There's a window to go there, there's a window to go there. Uh, so it's pretty self explanatory now for Tom um, to run it in. And um, so we're working here. So this is the wall we're going to set out now. But what I'm going to do is obviously I've got all this, these walls here, which is all around this area. So I'm going to. Now that we've completed this area, and we're not going to be working over there for the severe, we're going to be setting up the drawings over here, and it keeps them out of the way, and, it, and they're up high, they're easy access, they're, you know, they're not on a bit of paper, and you're getting them out and ripping them. So it's also good to get a set of A1s, um, I shouldn't have left these out overnight with the cold weather. That was, that was my bad. Um, but yeah, we're going to set these out. Right. She left her body and hovered above me. I saw no shadow. I looked around. Searched every building and home that I found. I saw no shadow. I felt a glow. The warmth inside me kept me afloat. Felt like heaven. I found my bones. Give me comfort. Now you're gone, I'm alone I guess it's time to get better Through the pain, I will go alone If I fall, break my bones I will scream even louder Cause I'm not dying alone I lost my best friend to 23 Left her body and hovered above me. Dying again and again I went through hell Instead of death But I keep fighting with each living breath I saw no way out From where I stood Felt like the fire had burned me for Now you're gone I'm alone I guess it's time to get better Through the pain I will go alone If I fall Best friend.
Yeah. You're right. Yeah. Stressing out, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How's your day going? Yeah, fine. Just, uh, just chatting some corners up today. I feel like building corners instead. Um, so what, what I do was, for the first course, I've just put in a, a nice, easy height, 225. I'm not going to try and bump it all in the first go if I'm going to build straight on it. So I've set my laser up for that corner over there. Once I've run this first course, I put my laser on it and it told me I've got to bump up 15 mil to be the same height as over there. So what I've done is bumped up five mil uh, each time. I've now got my to level uh, to 15 mil. So I know that this block here is gonna be pretty much bang on with that corner to gauge over there. So now what I'll do is I'll carry on building from this height up to gauge. Okay. Okay, makes sense. I'm high. Oh. Why are you plumbing it from behind? Because uh, I know. Because I can't get. I don't give you proper reading from there. Alright. It's a good thing about this whole block cut up, block split up. The amount of off cuts you use. The amount of hundreds you get every time it's always perfect always spot on so i would definitely recommend getting a block splitter Can I uh, get a bit of mud, please, Georgie? Can you just pull that off me? What's that? A glove? It's wet. It's making me freezing. A few more blocks as well, please, mate. Sorry, I'm slowing down a bit here, aren't I? Oh, that looks like a sign. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking stick, will ya? Twenty past one. I don't know how quick we've been using it up, really. That's something you've got to gauge. That's something you've got to gauge. I don't know how quick we've been using what you've been making. How long does it take for us to use a tub up? 
Yeah, I know. Come on, then. I don't know. All right. 20 past one, we've got hour and 25, hour and 25 minutes. I reckon, I reckon risk it and leave it. Yeah, we go. Yeah, all right. I'm gonna be not, I'm gonna be getting some recording done this afternoon as well, so. Yeah. You're the fastest out of all of us now, aren't you? <laughs> fucking eyelashes, I thought you had a set of fucking spiders on your eyes. Huh? <laughs> I thought a spider was stuck to your eyelashes. Right uh, we're bricklayers here, not fucking fashion parade. Woohoo! Woohoo! Have a bit of that later, please. Get laying tomorrow. Huh? <laughs> Get laying tomorrow. I'm gonna ring you awake, make sure you're waking up. You think not? Uh, <laughs> what a wanker, what a wanker. Language. What a wanker, what a wanker. Popcorn, what? <laughs> what a wanker, what a wanker. Oh. Do you want to point the back of this bit up for us, Georgie? Only once you've done, uh, yeah, we don't want to get Georgie's fucking, Georgie don't want to be in it, do you? Yeah, oh. uh, yeah I'll just finish doing that over there first. Yeah. Uh. Let's have a look. That's a fixed bubble. That's a fixed bubble. <laughs> so even if it's like that, it looks like it's blunt. <laughs> right, you're gonna book me in for a haircut? Because I'm sort of looking like, a, you know, I need one. <laughs> See that? What? <laughs> Haven't you got a window there? No, next course. Why have you put an arrow on that one then? Uh, that's where I'm gonna start. From. You get me, bruh. Tell me one thing you love about bricklaying. One thing I love about bricklaying. Uh, you're outdoors. That's horrible. It's <laughs> fucking freezing. It's <laughs> not cold, it's lovely. I'm freezing. And one with nature. Too quick to wrap up too warm. Oh, shut up. Push the old. Are you built that yet, Tom? <laughs> Where's this button gone? Oh, it's in the fork, it's the fork lift. Ain't you built that yet? No, not yet. Come on, Tobias. Are you gonna get Derek left for dead or what? <laughs> we will get a game that we will play eventually. Yeah, I know, it's still bad one to be bought. I know, I'm downloading Vanguard. Yeah, I'll go with that. Yeah. It comes out, it comes out in a uh, end of this week, isn't it? Yeah, Friday. Woohoo, early day Friday. <laughs> <laughs> no, you wouldn't. I fucking would. I tell you what, when um, Modern Warfare 2 come out, when I was about, fuck me, 19, I reckon, I, I told my boss I was ill, <laughs> so I could have a day, day off to go and get it and play it. <laughs> right. I'm gonna record again, this yeah. time, don't talk about fucking modern warfare. <laughs> it's boring, okay? Okay. I wanna see bricklaying. Right. <laughs> don't look up if you don't wanna be in the video. <laughs> I can see your hair, but that's it. I can't see your face, but I can see your fucking, uh, your eyelashes <laughs> like flickering. <laughs> fucking, I've never seen anything like it. I'll lay a brick for the YouTube family. You couldn't lay a fucking... <laughs> you couldn't lay a brick. 
Hey, Brick, you should lay in the toilet. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Right, all the internals are set out. Because I'm going to do corners, uh, can't really help do any more block work until I've got a few corners up. And these corners are big corners. There's a lot of bricks in them, so... Um, Tom's just getting some bricks over for me now. Some half bricks and some bricks. I like doing corners. Obviously, it's not as quick as all of you running in, but it's very stress-free for me because I'm just in one spot. Um, it's quite enjoyable for me to build corners, but you just don't make as much. But you... I'm just gonna build some corners. <laughs> what else should we say? I'm <laughs> seeing it. <laughs> right, let's go and have a look where we're going, shall we? Right, you crack on with them blocks, Georgie, and get that bit tidy, yeah? Right, we're gonna build this corner here. Um, this corner here. Uh, someone said about the telescopics. Yeah, you're right. But I, literally, I'm just gonna uh, see where I think I want them. I've only got to smash that out and it'll slide in. I know what you can say about the damp, but I'm just gonna grind out a bit of the bed and just tack, tack it in. I mean, I shouldn't really do it that way, but it doesn't really make a difference. I don't think it does anyway. Uh, but yeah, we're just gonna whack this corner up. Uh, and if I get the chance, I'll build this corner here as well. Um, to get a, to get a uh, full height corner, you wanna go about 12 bricks out, which is two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, which is about half fucking way. <laughs> so, uh, because it's Flemish bond, I might put a few tubes in it because it's, yeah, I make it look like a Christmas tree as it's Christmas.
It's one of the corners up. Like a little Christmas tree, doesn't it? <laughs> um, oh dear. Fucking hell. Just chucked up a little corner there. I uh, didn't use a level on that. I built it all without a level. I would put my level up it and show you how good it is, but you know. Hello? Hi. You alright? Are you on your way home? Yeah, I'm just on my way home now. What do you want with the jacket of potatoes? Uh, whatever you're having. I'm having beans. Yeah, cheese and beans, that'll do. Okay. Alright, see you in a bit. Bye. Love you, bye. I don't know if you can tell by the state of my eye, but I got something in it yesterday and it's been pissing me off. Um, if it carries on till tomorrow, there's something in there and it just keeps moving around, it ain't coming out. And sometimes it gets stuck and I literally it's fucking like my eye is just like eh, straight down my face. Oh, that's been pissing me off all day. <laughs> uh, fucking nothing worse. Anyway, I'm going to crack, smack this corner up tomorrow, butt into it, and I've got a fucking shit build down the side here. It's just no access, so it's going to literally be fucking walking shit. <laughs> or I might get someone to just fucking put the bricks up on here or something. I don't know what I'm going to do here, but fuck it. It is what it is. Oh, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll see you in tomorrow's.